Hello, my name is Paris the Connoisseur, and we're going to be going over once again fake items, replica bags, bougie on a budget, broken bougie, if you will. That, um, you know, I've brought, received, whatever. Yeah. And right now I'm still doing my AliExpress series or things that I've brought from AliExpress. And another thing that I wanted to say is I know a lot of y'all hate AliExpress with a burning passion. You feel it all in your soul. But they're honestly not that bad. And then moving on, besides that, like the thing on there is cheap. Like that phone case I brought in my last thing was like $3. But in the purse, fake Chanel purse is $35. But y'all want to be hard up about, oh, I got real this, I got real that. Why? Like, think about it practically it makes no sense for me to like in in reality it makes no sense for me to buy the same bag as you like if i just want it for the style it makes no sense for me to buy the same bag as you for the price that you paid for these thousands of dollars when i can buy the same same bag for 35 dollars and keep the rest of my thousands or if i spent a thousand on the real bag I could have just kept my 900 and whatever for myself but yeah so this, we're now we're gonna review a bag that I haven't worn or a phone case I haven't used and this is from Aliexpress and I just ordered this in December or November for my Christmas present and it's an off-white bag yeah came in this little dust bag it was cute so let me take it out so yeah, so the hardware is gold, first off, to start with. That's another strap inside that I can, like, exchange and interchange and show you. And it says off-white on the, um, yeah, on the actual strap. And then actually to just, like, present this and make it easier to show, I'm going to take it off. Oh, ooh, another thing that I've seen that I like is AliExpress sells these like interchangeable straps that say off white in different colors so they have one that's like blue purple this nasty orange brown color but you know it was there. maybe if you like that if you like that do you go off sis right but um yeah they have interchangeable ones and they're like ten dollars or fourteen dollars i guess you know sometimes they have sales and stuff but i can look on my phone right now and let you know how much how much this bag was okay let me see let me see let me see okay i paid 38 dollars for it i'm looking yeah 38 dollars for the bag yes it is backwards when i'm going to show you this but it's 38 dollars and it does in fact say off white tm right here on the little paper clip thing this moves up and down you know I mean, I haven't worn it yet, but it, and it's probably polyurethane, not real leather. Or maybe it's a different type of synthetic. Ooh, that's a little hard. It's actually real sturdy right here. But, um, yeah, there's that. Oh, the only thing I don't like about it is, actually, I don't know if you can see, like, at the top right here of the paperclip part, it looks kind of scratched up or it has little dots or something. I'm not a fan of that, but who's really going to be looking at that to know? And it also, it opens as the magnetic opening right here. So, you know, you close it and it's the magnet and then you got to pull it and that's the magnet. And it's, you know, you slide your finger under there. So, yeah, besides the yellow strap right here, they also gave me another strap that I haven't, like, used or taken out of the packaging. It also has gold hardware as well. So... Here it is. I can put it on the bag to show you what it looks like on. This is it on, you know. To be honest with you, I'm not a fan of it small and I would never wear it small. If you see me wearing it small, short, as an actual handbag instead of a shoulder bag, just know that day is not my day. But yeah, so when they sent it to me, it was filled with stuffing. 
And no, I did not take it out because I figured, let me record this little paper stuffing. Ooh. Okay, so when you first open the bag, there's a zipper right here. It's a little circle. Oh, let me. It's a little circle zip. You can open it and you can actually stick your hand in. And in the inside of this, I guess I didn't expect it to be like this because the other bag, it felt more like, you know, um, like a skinny pleather or something. But, um, this is like a cotton or a fabric. Actually, this almost feels exactly like this dust bag over here, but this dust bag just feels more thin. Like, if it has the same feeling to it. So, let me push the pocket back inside so that I can move on. And the inside of the bag is lined with that fabric, too. Actually, I can just pull it out and show you. The inside of the whole bag is lined with this fabric as well. I don't think I really like that, but, I mean, it's, it's there. I don't know if the real one is supposed to be like that. But it is what it is. The bag looks nice. Has nice stitching. No scratches or marks besides up here. The hardware is nice. The color is consistent. From the hardware to the little rings and clips and stuff on here. Everything looks nice. It doesn't feel cheaply made. I can't just, you know, pull it and break it. Would I recommend it? Yes. If you're a hater and you got a problem with people wearing fakes, no. Should have been left and exited the video. But you didn't. So you're here now. And that's okay. Because I know some of y'all don't actually hate me. Y'all just secretly like me. And y'all don't want nobody to know. But it's okay. So that concludes the video. Last strap. Actually, I should hold it up and yeah. But yes, that concludes the video. And that is. Oh wait, I have one more thing in my AliExpress thing. AliExpress. I don't know. Bad, bad and bougie, broken bougie thing that I can talk about. And it's a little cheap fanny pack that I got. But also, just let me know in a comments or just let me if you're my friend you can just text me and let me know if y'all want me to talk about things that i've ordered from aliexpress that were either absolute trash or other bad experiences i had besides thinking i got scammed when i maybe did maybe didn't all right bye